So I'm back, part two. Um, foreign exchange I was talking about. Anyway, long story short, uh, somebody came out in the garage as I was setting up and um, <laughs> was singing If I Were a Rich Man and here I am laying my coins out. Uh, this is what I have as far as foreign currency goes. I showed you the one franc earlier. This is a franc that I uh, picked up at the shop. Really pretty cool old coin with uh, with the axe on the back. I got a, you know, run-of-the-mill Canadian dime. Thought this was a really cool Canadian nickel. Never seen anyone any like this. Oh! It's, uh... I've never seen a Canadian nickel like this. 1927. Pretty cool. Um... Then, of course, you've seen these in the video, I think, all my Jamaican pennies. One penny, got three of those, different years. Um, and that is King Edward? King George, I'm sorry. King George the Sixth of India, it says. This is my pride and joy, my penny. My British penny. Come on, focus. There we go. 1907. I just love this. That's King Edward. Um, anyway, then I've got some uh, centimos, 10 pesos. You know me and my uh, me and my thirty-two dollar libertads. Um, I've got one piece here from India that a friend of mine, friend of the family, gave me. This, I think, is a good luck piece that's usually given out around weddings, and I've got the most incredible gold leaf uh, wedding invitation. I couldn't make it, obviously, to India to that, but this is 5 grams, 19, 0.999 silver. Um, there's a contact number on there, so if you got international calling, it's all good. But I've had this for probably 15 years or so. Um, very, very cool piece. But I wanted to give a big, big shout out to the stack collector. Uh, he is uh, he's right up there with 365 as far as the the uh, overseas programs that I watch. Go back and watch from three days ago his 250 sub gaw and see if there's any names in there that you recognize you might recognize one some grumpy old fella won something um the half crown and by by all means the 50p for some reason don't know that i'll uh i'll ever own all of those that i would like but the 50p is my absolute favorite coin in the world and uh yeah, I think you'll laugh when you see the outcome of this uh, of this giveaway. Um, I laughed and cried at the same time. Absolutely love this guy, the stack collector. He's quite a gentleman, and I would love for y'all to go check out his uh, YouTube channel. Um, he's doing really well. He's very very level headed, and uh, he's right up there with three six five in the in the uh, awareness of what's going on with the banking systems and all that sort of thing. So big shout out to uh, the Stack Collector, and uh, thank you so much um, for drawing uh, drawing my name for one of the prizes in there. And thank you so much for doing what I think you're going to do with with uh, the proceeds and that sort of thing. Anyway, that's a long story short. Oh look, my Chinese nickel. Somehow that always shows up. Anyway, wanted to give that shout out to you, to uh, the stack collector. Y'all go check him out. Let's give him to 500 subscribers pretty soon. And this obviously is not solid gold. But I'm telling y'all, community, be happy. We have this in the United States. And... We better start getting well organized, in my opinion. If you don't like what's going on and you don't do anything to change it, then don't bitch about it, right? Anyway, long story short is uh, 
thanks to Stack Collector. Go see his channel and keep stacking. Thanks, y'all.